Here is amazing Bell's Beach, the famous, the infamous surfer's capital of the world. Absolutely empty. This was on January 24th, a few days ago. And I was there early in the morning and I really didn't know this was the infamous uh, surfing spot of the world with our surfing tournaments. And I believe the movie Point Blank with Keanu Reeves and Patrick Swayze was filmed here but I had the luck as a hermit to find this fantastic beach absolutely empty and it was overcast that day and so I practiced yoga on the beach by myself for about an hour and then I meditated for an hour getting bitten alive by the mosquitoes but I can tell you this was an experience to never ever be forgotten and it was it's engraved in my mind as one of the most beautiful beaches I have ever seen in my entire life, especially that it was so empty and so quiet. When I told my friends that I had been on Bell's Beach and that it was empty, they were absolutely shocked because if you look at other YouTube videos, Bell's Beach is inundated and flooded with tourists and surfers from around the world. This is a busy place normally. And I was just traveling by myself and took a detour and it just happened to be alone. And I met one other lady who was jogging nearby and she said, it's absolutely delightful that there's nobody here. So she was also overwhelmed with enthusiasm at the lack of people as well. So I wasn't alone. So yes, look at this majestic place. It, it was really extraordinary. The silence, the serenity. This is Airy Inlet Beach on the Great Ocean Road. This was maybe 15 minutes away from where I was. And I was here at six in the morning and walked for about five kilometers. I saw the sunrise. And as you can see, it was an overcast day. So that was all the sun I would see for several hours. This end, but still spectacular, nevertheless. I was so blown away to see the sun and I walked and walked and I didn't really see anybody except the diehards or the locals on this beach so very few people were up at six in the morning walking on the beach and I hadn't planned for this trip I just got in in my car it took about two hours almost and more to get to this place this is peak season in uh, in Melbourne you know as we are in summertime here so the hotels were rather exorbitantly expensive. You can camp at the camping grounds or there's even youth hostels like backpacking hostels. But it was just unbelievable to do something spontaneous by myself. And that's the road up there that I was. And so you can see some of the houses. You can see the area. This was 6 in the morning. There was even a kangaroo outside my window. See Great Ocean Road. And yeah, this was a fantastic experience, a getaway without having to be so expensive on the budget. I just went to the supermarket along the way. I brought some fruit and so I didn't have to go to restaurants or have to deal with any of the, the new preliminary actions going on in the world. No, I just ate my watermelon in my car. Here's the wallaby that was outside my window that greeted me unbelievable the road less traveled so i really recommend you if you ever just feel like going and going on a road trip and you don't want it to be so expensive buy your food at the supermarket and go camping instead